Come out of the second half playing very aggressive. You score that second goal about 10, 15 minutes into the half. What kind of difference did that make for your game plan the rest of the night? Yeah, we told the girls at halftime, we said the first 15 minutes we're going to come out and the attitude is we're going to press and press and press. Um, and we pressed and we got the goal, and I think that changes the game because you get on the second goal. And sometimes 2-0 can be a danger, dangerous lead, but if you get it at the right part of the game, which I felt like we did, I felt like we kind of suffocated them a little bit and took control of the game and got the victory. And as, as much as you want to enjoy this one, you have to turn around and play a very good uh, Stephen F. Austin team tomorrow. What do you what do you do? Tell your girls. Uh, yeah, Stephen F. Austin's a good team. I mean, we've played them before and we've seen them before. So but they've been there. We've just played a very, very tough uh, non-conference schedule. So, I mean, we've played plenty of teams that caliber and, and we've beat teams that caliber and competed at that level. So, I mean, they'll be ready to go. I don't think they have to. It'd be told a lot just with our senior leadership and they have a lot of focus and a lot of intensity right now. I think they're going to be ready come game, game time. Jennifer, what can you say about your team's performance tonight? Um, their teams. Oh. I think we played uh, all around pretty good game. I think we do have a few things that we need to work on through the game coming up tomorrow because that's probably going to be our most important. Um, I would say that we were pretty organized and we did a little bit better finishing today, but we need to make sure that we do put away like all the opportunities that we do get. Yeah, you had a, a goal in the first period. What can you say about getting out to an early one nothing lead in a tournament like this? Um, I think that's really important because all year I think we've struggled with getting the early goal and we've kind of fought, had to fight to the very last last second, taking a lot of teams into overtime. Um, so it was really it was really important that we got that early goal. All right, and you uh, quick turnaround. You play again tomorrow at 4:30. Um, how do you prepare physically and mentally to do that? Um. It's going to be something we haven't done yet, but I think it's going to be good for us. I think that tonight we'll probably just try and relax, stay up our feet some, and get a couple stretches in, and we'll be good to go tomorrow, get our minds focused tonight and tomorrow. Big goal in the second half, about 15 minutes into it. What, is it, what does it do for the team's psyche to get up 2-0 early in the second half like that? Um, whenever you score a second goal, you get more confidence, and you're not as scared in the back, and it just lets you know like if they get one, then you're fine, you're still up one, but that still doesn't mean you stop fighting because a 2-0 lead is actually the worst. So we just kept going at it and didn't let him get one. And uh, tomorrow you, have, you guys face a very good Stephen F. Austin team. How do you, how do you prepare for them in such a short time? Um, like Jen said, we're just going to relax tonight and we're just not going to think about the past when we played them before because we're a whole new team and they're probably a whole new team. And we're just going to go into the mind know, or go into the game knowing that we're going to win and that we're going to be confident and just finish all of our opportunities.